everybody. Well, this is not somewhere I expected to be 12 years ago when I started Eye to Eye for the Leeds Fed City. I'm an ex-backpacker, an ex-English teacher, an ex-bus driver, I'm a mum of two. I started a company from about sit in Leeds. I made it the global player in ethical travel with offices on four continents. And I've recently sold it for millions to First Choice Travel, 11 years after I started. And I'm here to share with you some of the experience I've had along the way. Let me tell you about how I did my market research. I wanted to put on courses how to teach English as a foreign language. I knew that people just wanted to leave the country. Where did I put on my first course? This is a true story. I was driving out of Birmingham. Anybody live in Birmingham here? Good. I was driving out of Birmingham one November evening. It was really awful, drizzly evening, grey. I was on Spaghetti Junction. And this is what I thought. I thought, my God, this city is so ugly, people have got to want to get out of here. <laughs> And true to form, I put on my first ad there, my first course, filled it within a couple of weeks. That was my market research. I knew nothing. My recruitment policy was, when I first started to employ people, can you breathe? Are you cheap? You've got the job. <laughs> if I'm able to leave myself and if we're able to self-motivate ourselves, then that's great. But I cannot motivate anybody. All I can do as a leader is to say, this is where we're going. After consultation, of course. This is where we're going. This is a business vision. These are our values as an organization of how to get there. Once I've explained that clearly, then it's down to me to create some energy. It's not necessarily to motivate people, it's to say, do you know what guys, do you think we can do it? We're going there, we feel like this, do you think we can do it? Come on, let's give it a go. I don't accept the status quo. I think any company and any leader who is complacent in the 21st century has signed their own P45. I haven't forgotten where I've come from, which, which is why I'm interested in speaking at events like this and, and, and mentoring in Leeds um, for smaller businesses. I think it's very, very important to give it back. When things are going right at work and in business, this is how I feel. It's this, wow, I don't get emotional very often. Because I, I know what's going to happen here. I know when people come here and I know what the kids are going to get. Oh, we just need to make it happen. We just need to get people here. And finally, my mantra for the 21st century in business. Creativity plus speed is the new utopia. The rest, ladies and gentlemen, is just business bollocks. I like to think I'm quite an authentic person. You know, no bullshit with me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.